Aye, oh yeah, baby. Welcome to Chef Marquez and the kitchen. Hot day. Hey, look. Today, I'm cooking with some coals here. And what I'll be making in my cast iron pot is on do jambalaya. You're going to love it. Hey, it's awesome. I'll try to talk to you while I'm doing it, Chef. I'm not wearing my apron right now because hell, it's 108 degrees in the shade. That's what it feels like anyway. But you know me, I got to keep the sweat out of my eyes. Oh, damn, that's good. Anyway, cooking on coals, on Dewey Jambalaya. Watch me, babe. This thing here is going to go down good. When you make it like me, you made the miracle. Miracle on the bayou. Hey, talk to you at the wild. Aye, oh yeah, baby. Come on, baby, get that fire rolling. All right. Got my coals hot. Start getting my pot warm. Ready to cook. me about a third cup of cooking oil in there and I'm using peanut oil today because that's what I love my peanut oil and today I'm gonna use the local smoked sausage all right now she's starting to cook up Fry this baby up. I've got two links of Andouille sausage, and uh, they're not smoked, they're fresh. So, what I'm going to do is separate these, take the meat out once this is done, and I'm going to fry this down, fry that Andouille down. And I'll be frying it down using the my blend, pick sweet blend. And of course I'll be using some chicken broth today. And that's all gonna be so good because after I'm done with all this, I'm gonna go ahead and garnish it with sweet potato fries and uh, maybe some uh, Savoy sausage. And that's what that is. That's Savoy sausage from a local, a local store. All right, sausage is browned on one side. Now we're going to brown it on the other. And I'm going to go ahead and take, remove the casing from my own dewy. And don't forget, it's not a smoked on dewy; it's a fresh on dewy. And uh, you can pretty much get that at a, at a local meat market. You know, before they they smoke it, and I prefer it like that myself. Okay, I'm gonna let this fry on this side. On the uh, let this fry on the other side. Just let it go. When it's fried enough, I'll take it out, and then we're gonna start working on the on do it. Gotta have that grease hot. All right, now I'm gonna remove my uh, smoked sausage. Just want to brown it enough because that brown that you're seeing, I mean it, it's going to cook a whole lot more. But that that also that that helps get the uh, color into your jambalaya. All right, now removing the casing 
off of my own doing. Look at that. seasoning blend. Lots of onions and bell pepper, green and red, parsley, celery. Oh, well, that's got a whole bunch of stuff in there. Okay, I'm going to cover this up, let it cook down. We'll be back shortly. I'm out of brewskis. Gotta go get me a brewski, baby. Got some sweat mass. Aye, oh, yeah, baby. All right, let's see what's going on in the pot, baby. All right, this is cooking good. The veggies are melting down real good. Now, right now, couple of things I want to put in there, a couple of spices. One of them is a little garlic powder. I love my garlic powder. I guess maybe a quarter of a teaspoon or half a teaspoon. Depending on you what you want. Check this out. Best Stop Spices. Cajun seasoning, baby. And this stuff's hot. But I'm looking for a little heat. So I'm going to put maybe half a teaspoon in there. I was going to add salt. I don't have to add salt. Because my other ingredients has a lot of salt in it. Now I'm going to go ahead and add my chicken broth to that. And let it cook, baby. Let it cook for 45 minutes after once it starts comes to a boil. Put my sausage in there, cover it up, and let him let it do its thing. All right, let's see what we got here, baby. Okay, this been cooking 45 minutes. Let it go about 10 minutes more. And I'm going to start adding some rice to it. Look at that. Man, I tell you what, you just cannot believe it. I make my jum jambalaya a little bit different than everybody else. I like to put my rice in there, you know, uh, after the gravy is cooked, then I add the rice. Because a lot of people make the rice in it, but sometimes it's too dry. I don't like my jambalaya dry. Holy moly, holy moly, holy moly. Boy, I tell you what, this is awesome. If you could taste this gravy right here. Man. I'm going to leave the fire on right now. Get this rice in there and get it stirred up. Like I said, you put this jambalaya to the consistency you want.
All right, I'm gonna let it do its thing. I gotta go fry up some sweet potatoes and some uh, sausage. And I'm gonna garnish the top of it with sweet potato fries. I hear it. Yeah, baby. Hey, look, the chef book. I'm gonna talk with you later. I got my on duty jambalaya ready for the night. Hey, it's gonna be fun time at the house. The people sitting around my table is gonna really enjoy this stuff. Anyway, I'm gonna talk to y'all later. Glad I was able to entertain you. Hot dang. Come see me at Palmetto Island State Park in Abbeville, Louisiana this Saturday. Oh man, I tell you, I surprised myself. Whew. Time to go. Subscribe and you got your thumbs up. Aye, oh yes.